Hello and welcome to History Pod. On the 23rd of September 1949, President Truman announced that the Soviet Union had successfully detonated its first nuclear weapon. The USSR began its nuclear program in 1943, assisted by intelligence from sources inside the USA's Manhattan Project. This helped the USSR's program to develop quickly, as the Soviets were able to replicate American successes while avoiding some of their costlier mistakes. Although the majority of Cold War academics accept that the USSR's success had a lot to do with domestic expertise, they also recognise that foreign intelligence helped to reduce the time it took for them to develop the bomb. Work took place in secret, purpose-built cities dedicated to the nuclear programme, known as Atomgrads. By 1949, the Soviets had developed two types of bomb and opted to detonate the simpler of the two designs first, since it was similar in design to the successful Fat Man bomb that had been dropped on Nagasaki. Known as the RDS-1, the bomb's first test was conducted in secret in an attempt to avoid the USA increasing its own nuclear program. The explosion had the power of 22 kilotons of TNT and was 50% more destructive than expected. Despite the attempts to maintain secrecy, the US monitoring stations also recorded seismic activity that suggested an underground nuclear test had been carried out. The USSR's successful detonation occurred four years ahead of American estimates, prompting Truman to order his scientific and military advisers to recheck their data. Once confirmed, Truman prepared a brief statement to the media, although he sought to downplay the seriousness of the situation by saying, The eventual development of this new force by other nations was to be expected. This probability has always been taken into account by us. Thank you.